today's not a day to wag fingers and, and, to, and to assign blame. Today is a day to stick out an olive branch and say we are willing to work with everybody on this state and turn Connecticut into a, a, a state that businesses can't refuse to come to. That you need to be here and do business in the state of Connecticut. Tell me what's been done around here in the last 20 years that makes your job easier. How about nothing? How about nothing? Thank you for being up in Hartford today. I think this is the largest group we've seen in a long time and certainly the largest group for realtors we've ever seen up here in Hartford. So thank you for being out here today. And we want to hear those voices. We want to hear you involved in your government. And by being here today, you're doing that. I hope no one's trying to sell a house in Connecticut today because we're all here. Uh, you have a great crowd and we really appreciate it. This is incredible having over 2,000 realtors uh, descend on Capitol Hill. Uh, if you want to think about your voices being heard, today they are being heard by all the legislators that you've seen up on stage. Not only today, but for the last few years, we've heard and we've seen people talking about, and businesses talking about moving out of Connecticut. We, you and I, are here to tell the legislature that things must change. I really want to thank you folks for doing this. Uh, it's so, so important. Your message just couldn't be more appropriate. Uh, the timing couldn't be more appropriate. We really are at a critical point in, in, our, in the state of Connecticut. Because you are on the front lines, you do see who is coming and going, and you know from firsthand knowledge that people are leaving Connecticut. You know that people don't want to buy houses and therefore people aren't able to sell their houses. You know that because you do it every day. That's not a story. That's not spin. That's not politics. That's reality. There were some that thought we couldn't put a thousand people here. We've doubled that. So I want to thank you all. Today we lead with the olive branch and we, we, we commit to put our shoulders behind this. But in the future, perhaps if we don't get what we want, we'll put our shoulders behind replacing the people that didn't get us there.